The cultural districts of Minneapolis revel in the motto of every neighborhood having its own flavor. Whether that's Sabor Latino in Holy Land over in Northeast Minneapolis on Central Avenue, Barakala Restaurant and the Cedar Cultural Center over in the Cedar Riverside neighborhood, or even Mercado Central in Los Ocampo over on Lake Street. And these cultural districts help Minneapolis stay a city on the bubble, changing and relevant today and for years to come. It's not just another day in your life. Things are changing for the better. At Comcast, we see those changes and we're thinking about how we use technology today to live, work, learn, and play. And we're building for the future now, so we're better prepared for the wants and needs of tomorrow. That's why Comcast is rolling out multi-gig internet speeds to more than 50 million homes and businesses before the end of 2025, making our already industry-leading network even faster, smarter, greener, and more reliable. Over the decades, Comcast has been your partner, working hard to serve your community, and will continue to be your partner. We're expanding our gigabits so you can enjoy the tiny bits that matter most. You want a healthier lifestyle, but how do you get started? Then stick with it by listening to the Fitness Revolution podcast with Shay Sandifer, of course. Your journey to greater well-being starts now. Hello. How is everyone? It's Coach Shay with Fitness Revolution. Do y'all love my hat? Don't you love it? It's a farmer's market vibe. Yes, it is. Do you not love the colors? So I didn't realize when buying this, I was just buying this because I love hats, love, love hats. And then someone's like, oh, you're representing pride. And I was like, you know what? Look at Jesus. I am. So here's to Pride Month. Happy Pride Month. Uh, happy to um, everyone that's uh, receiving love this month. So if this is what it means, this is what I'm representing is a love, peace and kindness. So that's what the hat's for today. Kind of, but I wore it for a reason while we're talking today. So I have a thing that I'm doing this summer, and this is my wellness as well as incorporating the fitness, right, and some nutrition. So with that being said, I have set a goal out to do 75 walking meetings by the end of September, so by September 30th. And why I made this decision, A, I need to drop about 20 pounds. Let's just keep it real. But the bigger things is we've been sitting. This is all I need to talk about, right? Every few episodes, I talk about us getting up and moving and being active. So I said, what better way than people keep reaching out? They want to have all these meetings, right? They want to talk. And I was like, I'm over Zoom. And I'm kind of over sitting in the office. And since our summers are short, but sweet and beautiful, why not present everybody with a walking meeting? I created a great path that I found over by my office that gives me exactly 2.19 miles. You can't beat that, right? Your heart rate's up. You've had a great workout. I'm going to tell you guys right now. So walked for um, 47 minutes. Um, active calories, 214 total calories burned in that walk 341 can't beat that y'all so that's my goal and today i just had my 22nd walk today so for some reason i got scheduled three walking meetings today <laughs> and so it's okay so we did one this morning i just got done with one and then i have one at four so i'm gonna walk probably almost seven miles today it's not even that hard, y'all. But at the best, the best thing is I'm getting CEOs, I'm getting CFOs, I'm getting entrepreneurs, I'm getting chefs, I'm getting people in IT to get out and business development to get out and walk with me and talk about business, talk about their aspirations, talk about their goals, whether it's their fitness goals, their wellness, their nutrition, and most importantly, their business goals, right? It brings a different synergy to this walk of about what we are doing and why we are here and what our true wellness is. And I haven't had one person turn me down. As a matter of fact, of the meetings this week so far, everybody has asked, can they have another walking meeting with me? Say less. So not our, only are we going to be fine by September 30th, which my birthday is October 4th, but we're also going to have great, great, authentic, courageous, 
um, innovative conversation, right, around business, around health, about, around what we're doing as a community. And that's the biggest point right there, right? You can't beat that. So I hope you guys get out and walk. Tell your boss, tell that next meeting, tell your friends that you want to have a walking meeting and get outside, put your tennis shoes on. If you have a dress on, I kind of have like a, it's like a fitness thing, but I got a jumpsuit on with this dress. I just saw some ladies walking. They all have their dresses on with their tennis shoes, right? Switch it out like Mr. Rogers, you will be great. <laughs> but just think about that. If we all got out and walked together, what we could create and what we could heal, right? That's the biggest thing that I'm always talking about is healing from the inside out. This is healing. This is creating positive energy. It's creating positive uh, people around you and it's gonna help elevate you to the next level. Keep walking, keep walking. So I am taking pictures with everyone I walk and I'm gonna do a whole post on this at the end of September. So the beginning of that fall of October about what this journey looks like. So like I said, today I will be at number 23 by my next walk. And so then I have, how many is that, y'all? What's that then? I'll have 52 left. That's 52, not too bad. So I got all of July, all of August, all of September. So three dividing that. So I'll be averaging about 20 walks a month. There's 30 days in each month, and some of those months, there's 31. I think I can do it. I think I can. Just think if I walked twice every day. I'm going to be so fine. Look, this fitness revolution with Shay is not, it's not, not going to be any joke. You guys better be ready for what this is. So keep incorporating these wonderful things, right? Applying simple things, walking drinking your water, having positive conversations, right? That's all what we're about here at Fitness Revolution. It's about evolving and, re and revolving constantly, right? What are we doing to keeping this going? I feel so good. As you see, I can't stop smiling today because I've had such great conversations. I've released any negative energy. I really feel like anything I was stressed about has left my body. So all I can think about is positive things and what I can put back into my work, what I can put back in the community and what I can put back into my family. So that's what I have for y'all today. So happy Pride Month again. I can't wait to see y'all next week. I have lots to tell you. There's so many great things going on. Um, I'll tell you next week, though, so I can't wait to tell you everything that's going to happen. But keep being positive. Keep being healthy. And as always, inhale the positive, exhale the negative. This is Coach Shea with Fitness Revolution. See you soon. Bye. Check back next week for more on living your healthier lifestyle and share previous episodes of Shay's podcast with your friends. Log on to ShalettaMakesMeLaugh.com. Hi, I'm Shaletta Burnage. I'm a media personality, podcaster, and a business owner. But my most important role is mom. Three of my beautiful kids have been diagnosed with autism spectrum disorder. When I didn't know who to trust or where to turn, I found Agra. Acra provides home care services to families all over Minnesota. The care is not one size fits all. They know each one of my kids is unique. They listen to what resources we needed and what's best for our family. I've seen my kids grow and thrive with Acra's in-home care. While autism is the most common diagnosis among Acra clients, Acra offers personalized in-home care services for people with disabilities, chronic illnesses, behavioral diagnosis, and mental illness. They work with children, adolescents, and older folks too. Find out more about ACRA at their website, acrahomecare.org. ACRA helps me provide my kids with a better quality of life. They can do it for your family too. Children's Minnesota, the leader in specialized health care for kids, is here to raise awareness, standards, the bar, the stakes, the question, the curtain. On raising kids' health to the highest priority, kids need equal access to health care, more pediatric expertise, a voice for change. Kids need us, all of us. So let's raise them up. Children's Minnesota, the kid experts. Are you up to date on your COVID-19 vaccinations? It's not a one and done situation. You and your family may have gotten the original COVID-19 vaccine, but the virus keeps changing. And now new variants are circulating in our community and continue to make people sick. 
Getting updated COVID-19 vaccines will protect you from the original strain and these newer variants. The number of updated doses you need depends on your age, your health conditions, and your previous vaccinations. So talk to your doctor or healthcare provider to be sure you've received at least one updated vaccine and boosters. Do you worry that lead-based pain in your older home might be dangerous to your children or kids who visit you? Well, Hennepin County put those fears to rest. Hennepin County offers free lead tests and home assessments. If they find anything, eligible homeowners and landlords can receive up to $15,000 for work on the home, including new windows. The government banned lead-based paint 45 years ago when it was discovered that lead poisoning can affect development and cause permanent damage in young children. But 75% of those homes built before 1978 still contain some lead-based paint. As the paint degrades, it can make dust that little kids ingest when they're crawling and putting things in their mouths. So make sure your home is safe and hazard-free. Learn about testing in that $15,000 grant at hennepin.us backslash lead control. That's hennepin.us backslash lead control. You know Shaletta makes you laugh, but did you know Shaletta Brundage can also make you think and boost your business? Media personality, activist, and comedian Shaletta Brundage founded Shaletta Makes Me Laugh to celebrate and share the best of black culture. It's a podcasting platform. You can download 10 weekly podcasts hosted by African-American subject experts at ShalettaMakesMeLaugh.com or wherever you find your favorite podcasts. ShalettaMakesMeLaugh.com is also a production house creating broadcast quality commercial content. And Shaletta and her team of storytellers create powerful promotional campaigns to get businesses the brand awareness they're looking for. Some of Minnesota's top businesses trust Shaletta, and you can too. Get out the word about your events and products and get in front of communities of color with ShalettaMakesMeLaugh.com. She's got the power to help your business.